With over 7,000 employees in over 1,300 locations in Trinidad and Tobago, the National Maintenance Training and Security Company Limited was described as a prime example of a self-sufficient state-owned enterprise. From its beginnings as purely providing services to educational facilities 45 years ago, the MTS has expanded to include a number of other crucial services. On Wednesday, the company celebrated its 45th anniversary and launched an added service, the Special Elite Security Unit. Minister of Finance Common Birds during his address explained that MTS is the only company functioning without government subventions and is testament to its resilience and consistency. To a multifaceted service leader demonstrates its adaptability and responsiveness to the nation's needs. As I indicated, beyond security, the company offers engineering solutions, green space management, agribusiness, aimed at su supporting community well-being and environmental sustainability. This comprehensive and broad-based approach positions it not only as a service provider, but a cornerstone of national development. Minister Imbert said this special elite security unit's rigorous selection process will ensure only the best candidates are selected to provide these high-stake services. The introduction of the special elite security services marks a strategic enhancement in specialized high-caliber protection services. There's definitely an increasing need for this type of customized expert solution. This offering meets the demand by providing specialized services such as executive escort, protection and security for high priority facilities and VIPs. Prospective special elite officers must have at least five years of experience, undergo intensive training, polygraph tests and background checks.